It literally takes down from zero to like 100 real quick. <laughs> hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my summer essentials. So basically I'm going to be going through all the products, fashion, beauty, all that kind of stuff that I think are essential for the summertime. This video is in collaboration with Lindsay Marie. She has an amazing, amazing channel. So she does fashion, beauty, makeup videos, all that kind of stuff. Um, her editing is really, like, way better than mine. So <laughs> if you want to see amazing editing, check out her videos. I will have everything linked down below for you all. She's going to basically show you her summer essentials. So this way you get double the amount of summer essentials and you can see the difference between our summer essentials because we're obviously two different people. So, so my first fashion essential for summer is definitely sunglasses. These are my go-to pair. They're kind of like D-frame, I guess you would call them. Um, I love these sunglasses so much. But I've had these for probably three years. I think they're the only sunglasses that I've not completely lost in my life. So, so these are definitely a necessity. And my next summer essential is high-waisted denim shorts. I have two different pairs for you all here to show you. This first pair is from Gats. I love these so much. They have like the frayed hem at the bottom and they're really, really distressed. I just think that denim shorts are like something that will never go out of style in the summer. Like how long have de denim shorts been in style for? Like literally forever and I don't think they ever will go out of style so they're definitely unessential for the summertime. The other pair is from Garage and they're kind of like this lighter, like really blue kind of color. I love these. They roll up at the hem and they're just really cute and denim shorts literally go with everything and they're just scream summer to me. I specifically like high-waisted ones the best as they make my legs look longer so but either way denim shorts the best and essential for summertime. And my next um, fashion essential for summer are definitely like kimonos. Um, this one is from Forever 21. It has like fringe at the bottom. As you can see, I've worn it in my last video. And these are just amazing to put together an outfit. Like, you throw a kimono over your outfit and it literally takes down from zero to like 100 real quick. My last fashion essential for summer is some bikinis. My first one is definitely, if this summer, the biggest trend ever, triangle style bikinis. This is not a triangle bikini because I can't bring myself to order one. Um, this is from Victoria's Secret, but it looks exactly the same, so <laughs> I don't really care. Anyway, this one, obsessed, probably my all-time favorite bikini that I own. Can't wait to actually wear it, haven't worn it yet. <laughs> um, and these are the bottoms that go with it. They're like really, really cheeky, which I love. And then my next bikini essential are black tops. I am obsessed with black bikinis. I think that black bikinis are the most flattering bikinis that you can possibly wear. I think they look the best. I don't know if that's just me, but I love a good black bikini. So right now I have two different tops to show you. I don't have matching bottoms with these. These go with anything. I will mix these with any bottom that I own. So the first one is this one. This is from Forever 21. And it's kind of like a sportier style. So the back of it is all like rope detailing like this, which is so pretty. I love this one. It was super cheap too, like probably around $15, $20. And then the other one that I have is this just plain triangle bikini, but it has fringe on the front of it. I've had this for so long. It's from Ardeen. I think this was like $10 or $15, so a super good deal for a bikini. It's lasted me forever. It hasn't faded, anything. It's amazing. I pair this with everything, and I love it. Sorry, that was not my last fashion favorite. My last fa fashion favorite is definitely a really small purse like this one, especially in a color. If you're going to pull out a colored purse, you got to do it in the summertime. This one is from Fossil. It's kind of like a dirty green color. <laughs> Ooh, that sounds appealing. Dirty green. It's kind of like a muted green. It probably was brighter when I, I've had this for like four years or something, and I would use it every single summer. It's perfect size. You don't want to carry a giant bag in the summer as it's hot out, and you don't want to find any reason to sweat, do you? So the first ones are nail polishes. I think if you want to pull out your bright, ridiculously loud nail polishes, do it in the summer. Um, this one is from Madame Glam. It's in Be My Baby. It's like a neon pink color. Love this one. I wear it on my toes all the time. Um, the other one that I love for the summertime is this blue color. It's called Mermaid Island and I just think it's super pretty. And that also is from Madame Glam. And then my favorite Essie nail polishes, Essie nail polish in the summer is Turks and Caicos. 
yeah, Turks and Caicos, another one, or Turquoise and Caicos, Turquoise and Caicos. Um, I have my Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue Tinted Hydrating Gel Cream. This stuff is definitely the best product, I think, for the summer, foundation wise. It's extremely moisturizing, cooling on your skin, which is good. You can't see it. It's not one of those products that in the heat or humidity it's going to sweat off your face. It definitely will stay on there. It's really light. It just has um, SPF of 30 in it. It's just probably the best thing ever. I really highly recommend this for the summertime. It's amazing. If you haven't already tried it out, do so immediately after you watch this video. You go buy this freaking great. And then I have two lip products. Um, my favorite lipstick that I majorly pull out all in the summertime is the lipstick in Crosswires from MAC. It's just like the perfect pinky, reddish, coralish, bright lip in the summer. It looks so good with a tan. It literally looks amazing with a tan. Not even so good, amazing. If you're looking for a great, bright, but not too bright lipstick to wear in the summertime. Crosswires by MAC. It's a cream sheen, so it's moisturizing, which is great. Best lipstick for summer. And then my other favorite, I think these are discontinued, but any kind of tinted lip balm is amazing in the summer. This one has SPF, which again is really important because if you've ever burnt your lips, it's horrendous, so try and avoid that. This is Petting Pink Tinted Lip Conditioner from MAC. This is amazing for summer. It gives your lips some color, but it keeps them hydrated, protects them from the sun. And then my last and most important summer essential is stuff to do with your skin. And that is sunscreen, ladies and gentlemen. Find a brand Be Better. It's kind of like an all natural kind of sunscreen. This is SPF 30. Um, it has UVA and UVB protection. It's water resistant. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Wear sunscreen. It's good for your skin. You want to protect it, especially if you're like me and you have little molds all over you because you don't want to get no skin cancer. Now do you? I don't think so. And then my next favorite along with that is to get some kind of aloe thing. Especially if you're going to spend all day out in the sun or say you're going to a beach or whatever have you, whatever you want to do. If you are been in the sun all day, the best thing you can do for your skin when you come back is just put a bunch of aloe all over you. One, it feels really good because it's cooling. And two, it's really good for your skin. This contains vitamin A and E. Um, it's just really, really amazing. This is by the brand Hawaiian Tropics. And I've had this forever and I use it every time after I tan and it just stops you from burning too. If you have a burn and you put this on, it will turn into a tan. Proven. I've proved it. So. so those are all of my summer essentials. I hope that you guys enjoyed this. Again, don't forget to check out Lindsay's video. Hit the subscribe button if you like this video and you're new to my channel or if you came from her video and you're like, hey, you know subscribe <laughs> also thumbs it up if you enjoy it really helps me if you give this a big thumbs up because then i know that you liked what i made and it's just really good also thank you so much for 60,000 subscribers i don't have 60,000 yet but i'm sure by the time this goes up i will because i'm very close <laughs> i just want to say thank you again for that because that's really amazing i gained i'm so close i just want to get to 100,000 so bad like and explain how that looks. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this and